Denver 7 On Demand is brought to you by Ferguson and BAC Appliance Center. The best in bath, kitchen, and lighting for your home. I'm Tom Mustin with the latest from Denver 7. More than a dozen senior citizens are still waiting to learn when they can return home after a deadly fire at a Littleton apartment complex it happened Saturday morning. They're now staying at a shelter provided by the Red Cross. That fire killed 70-year-old Michael Mitchell. The apartment complex says they still need to do an air quality inspection before people can go back home. Well, the Broncos picked up their first win in a month. Denver stunned the San Diego Chargers in Los Angeles 23 to 22. The Broncos are now four and six on the year. They'll take on the Pittsburgh Steelers next week. And CU has parted ways with head football coach Mike McIntyre. Athletic director Rick George says it was simply time for a change. McIntyre led the bus for six seasons and had a record of 30 and 44. The team's interim coach will be quarterbacks coach Kurt Roper. And from the First Alert Weather Center, here's a check on your forecast. Sunny and nice tomorrow with a high of 50. Really nice for Thanksgiving. Sunny and a high of 57. Then reality sets in. We're back to snow and chilly temperatures by Sunday. This has been your Denver 7 On Demand Update. Thanks for joining us. Check back here later for another update and download the Denver 7 app for breaking news and alerts. I'm Tom Mustin. Have a great day.